Nick Travis. This is not the Nick Travis. This can't be. Hey there, how's it going, man? Yeah, what's up? Yeah, what's up? So, anyway, I'm a freelance journalist. I, I saw you posted my thing. You want to tell us the truth. It's no big deal. So, would you like to answer a couple questions on Ale? Not really, no. Not on on what? <laughs> on Ale? I, 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 I mean, think you want to answer a couple questions. No, not really. Listen, no, wait, wait. First off, who are you? Oh. First off. Okay, so you already have my info, <laughs> and you're already doing this. Anyway, <laughs> no, so wait, how do you no, feel wait, about no, being no, Wait, is this, no, is this Elmer no, Fudd? What no, the wait, fuck? Wait, Did Fudd come back? No, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, first off, first off, wait, hold on. Can I explain? So first off, Killstream.tv, let's attack Killstream.tv. They got some info out no, there. No, wait, wait, no, wait, you shut up. You shut up, or I'm going to throw you out. If you'll no. act, if you'll act, okay. Yeah, okay. If you'll act, so, okay. No, wait, no, no, no. No, shut up. I was a pedophile wife, buddy. No, shut up. Oh, hey, you're a the man. man. You want, you, I recognize oh, that man. voice. He won't even you shut up. Why was it, how is it he being Corey Barney? He won't even you shut up. You cocksucker. It's, it's so His funny. cock is great. I love his palm. Well, it sounds like you, f- hey, you fucking do. What a fucking loser. Like you love calm. I have to you have to suck off the guns, fucking calm. Wow. I get zoomed. Oh, did That's you like, stutter you there? Did I get you upset, little bitch boy? Oh, you did. I wish I could look at a Trader Joe's like you, Shannon. I just wish I could look uh, at a see, Trader Joe's. See, I this broke the mask like right the there. F- I, f- I exposed the nose right How fucking there. You guys are so sound. fucking <laughs> butthurt <laughs> that I even exist. <laughs> that it took yeah. no effort at all to make the mask yeah. slip. This is why nobody likes you guys. Because you are complete and total fucking losers. Hey Nick, how's oh, it going, buddy? Did it, you know, Did it work out? Did it work out how you thought it would work out? Did it work out how you thought it would work out? Shannon, that's hurtful. You know, oh, Shannon, please you sound. Oh, you literally no. sound right. like the gayest yeah. I've ever no, heard. No, no, like. sh- no, you, you literally did. You, shut up? you sound. Shannon, no, fuck you, Shannon, bitch. Shannon, fuck you, bitch. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. Rob, Burn it out. Get out Rob. of here. Get out of here, bitch. You've said. Oh you no! Said oh, he's gonna call me Shannon. Oh boy. Oh no. Well, it's just like calling me. Martritrius or some shit. Like, it's not even like... I don't know. You can just call Maurice. It. Yeah, exactly. Martritrius. That's just something I made up, by the way. I've never heard that name, but... That is literally the gayest sounding caller I think we've ever had, dude. I left He, like, on. tried to put on, like, a fucking scuffed Elmer Fudd voice, and it was like, oh, wait a minute. I recognize this fucking voice. I was like, you're just a fucking play <laughs> That's all I was. Corey Barnhill's a beta bitch, boys. But he... Then he started talking about how much he enjoyed calm and shit. It's like, okay. yeah, he did. It's like, dude, okay, you know what? I left him on. You know, that's I was gonna kick him at first, and then he started like he sounded so gay and so pathetic. I left him on the air because I was like, why am I gonna kick this guy? Because he's actually showing how fucking gay and how fucking lame like all these people are. This is the average Ralph hater right <laughs> yeah, fucking right. there. That's why I didn't kick him immediately. That's why I gave him like four or five minutes because like, dude, why why would I kick this guy? This is perfect. Uh, so anyway, that's that's a it's thing. It's what you call a teachable <laughs> moment. That's a thing. And I love how I just started rattling his cage a little bit, and he just drops the mask immediately. Oh, yeah, fuck you, Shannon Trader Joe's. Oh, no. Oh, God, that, that cut me so By deep, way, sir. First off, you don't work at Trader Joe's, but if you did, Trader Joe's is a good ass job, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Like, <laughs> you could actually fucking Trader Joe's is not the worst fucking job you could ever have at all. Go ahead, Chris. Stubb. You could work at a Walmart. Yeah, exactly. Hey. Go ahead. Hey, what's up, Ralph? How you doing? I'm doing all right, buddy. What's up? Uh, also, what's up, uh, Gator? Glad to hear you. Uh, you sound better. And that you're feeling better. <laughs> I'm feeling a lot better. I think my body has overcome the uh, the, the cancer juice. Nice, dude. Right on. Uh, so a couple things. Uh, Ralph, congratulations on the four of a kind. You hit on that. Uh, <laughs> you saw that, that, huh? Oh, yeah. Dude, yeah. Thank you. I'm just a little disappointed that you weren't max betting. Oh, you made dude, some I would have made so much. If I'd been max betting. Oh, don't get me started. Anyway, yeah. Um, the other thing you, I don't know if like, maybe you had like pre-listened to and didn't think it was that interesting, but that I I did get a call from some Kiwi farm about like 40 minutes ago and caught the tail end of it. And I'm actually fairly certain that the guy who you just had on your call is the same fucking person. And I like the voice is super similar. So I don't know if you want to pull that up and maybe like cross analyze that. Yeah, You know what? Send the call because. Um, basically there's some like 
third world who probably lives in like Mongolia or you know some similar country to that and they're like you know water is dripping in you ever seen one of those movies where they live in the shack and the and the water the, the little drop is just coming in it's like hitting them in the forehead while they're sitting here trying to shit post while they're sitting here trying to Chinese fuck with water the, torture yeah, slowly while, burrowing while its way into his brain while they're, while they're trying, no, 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 while they're trying to fuck with the kill streak one drop is like dropping down dropping on their face the whole time just driving them further and further into madness that that is the type of individual that we're dealing with here. They they're broken broken English and they, and they're just like sweating, sweat mixed in with the drop of water. That that's what we're dealing with here. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Some guy that just has not doesn't even ha can't can't even have an enjoyable uh, one single enjoyable moment in right. his entire life. It's true. Uh, it's, uh, uh, yeah. No, he called he called me with a block number, so <laughs> give me the last. Last four digits of my credit card number with the expiration date and all this shit. And I'm like, okay, what bank are you calling from? And I'm over here trying, I'm like pulling out my credit card, trying to verify all this shit. And then he starts talking some fucking dumb shit about lizards. And I'm like, wait a sec. I'm like, I'm like I, I knew it was suspicious from the beginning, but like I knew after he started, he's like, have you ever heard of lizards? And I'm like, this is some Kiwi fucking farm. Yeah, like what the fuck is so going you mean on? They're here? literally tr going around trying to fucking scam people. By the way, that's <laughs> also a federal offense. By the way, dude, they're so deep into like criminal shit now. Like it's not even it's not even me just saying that. Like it's just blatant criminality over there. Yeah. Uh, but the good thing is, like I said, I, I I sent out the email. I talked to as many people people as I could. It's not what they're claiming it is uh it's still not great you know things like this uh, unfortunately look, happen they, but they got um, my name they yeah, got some information they that they can't that, that they can't really use to right. like actually steal any of my money exactly so like, oh, yeah that's fine. they have just and enough it's... information to like be annoying basically right, <laughs> like, right. Yeah, yeah hold on wait let's yeah, say this annoying, or wait, 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 wait. can't stop won't stop long live the kill stream yeah. 100 fire thank you for that so much jen i really appreciate that go ahead go ahead caller and shout out to jen thank you so much go ahead i was gonna say if they got anything else and they're gonna try to like do some shit in person uh so, just know that i've got well, personal look, defense well look mechanism. so they they uh, got emails and they got phone numbers um and so what they did and they got like the plus the the four plus four info or whatever um uh, which you can't really do anything with um but they try to act like oh we have addresses we have credit cards we have all this and that and their whole goal and i said this in in the email and i said this in the little short video i did basically their goal is to shut down this show their goal is to stop our fun. Their goal is to see me go away forever um, and this show to cease. Uh, and it's not just me either. They attack people like Gator who actually who don't deserve it. You know what I mean? Uh, myself. I've literally never done anything well, no, to well, except for well, being well, 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 You're saying well, I deserve well, it? Well, no, I want to finish. I want to finish. Because, you know what? I don't think I deserve a lot of the things either, but you know what? I, I'm also an asshole, and I'm also that guy who just, like, says, bring it on. And so when you're that type of person, I'll let this finish. Ralph, if you stumbled into a cheap glory <laughs> hole in Vegas by accident, would Ponsu get mad if you could argue there was a good chance no. there was a dude on the other side? No, she would not be cool with that. But um, so I, I guess I feel like I do bring a lot of it, some of it at least, on myself maybe even a lot of it. And so I can accept that, right? Um but but the way they've treated people around me um and people who actually like I said don't deserve it at all and who were measured in their responses and who try to stay out of things and they still tried to fucking dox them, they still tried to fuck with them, fuck up their life, fuck with, you know, fuck with their family. And it's like, dude, don't, didn't you have enough fucking with my family, fucking with my life? Yeah, I, don't, it, I don't know. It, it really is. It really does annoy me on that level. People who, who are just good people who are not me, they don't have the dirt. They don't have the, you know, the burden that I have from the things I've been through and, and done and, and just lived through. 
And it's like, why are you bringing them into this? It's just really it, it's, fucking pathetic. It, yeah. What it is, is it's an intimidation tactic to try well, to either yeah. get people who are already subscribed to be afraid and then like retract their information, which it's... I mean, if you've already got all this information to begin with, then like, I like, I don't know, like what else, if you're not going to present any, any more information than what you've already said, trying to like be like, Oh, the last four digits of your bank card and you know, the, the expiration date and I know what your name is and all this kind of stuff. Well, if you've already got all of that, then <laughs> I mean, what else is there for me to like, why would I unsubscribe? Because yeah, you've you got already have everything. Yeah. Was, uh, and, um, yeah. And, and, and then it, it, it's also to try to like prevent new people from being like, well, fuck, I, mean, I don't want to, I don't want to give my information to, uh, to this website now because look at these, these people. But uh, like all it is is, and, and I, I sent you the link because I caught the very tail end of this fucking caller um where i'm calling him out on on his bullshit which like i said i i i hope that you listen to it because i swear to god it's the it's the same voice as the last caller okay, that you just had to, where did you post it because maybe we'll, I, well play I, it on the show i sent it to you in in uh twitter dms and i also just posted it in um suggest stories okay if it's if it's in suggest stories i'll pull it up then um yeah and 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 again it's it's what I said. I know I went into a long tangent there, but it it just boils down to this: they want to scare people into not supporting this yep. show, and yep. and it, it it has nothing to do with those people. Anything they've done, it has to do with they hate me, and they don't want me to be able to make a living doing what I do. And so and, and they've got no fucking life. Hi, They're a bunch of fucking streams. losers. Exactly. Still a kill stream. TV faithful. Bunch of Fuck fucking like. losers. Thank you, Chris. I appreciate it, brother. All right, man. Talk to you later. All right, talk to you soon. All right, now, let me re repeat that. But, yeah, I mean, that's what it is. And, again, it would be great if that wasn't, like, a thing that I had to deal with, everybody else had to deal with. But it is. And, you know, like I said, I put my phone number out there. I talked to, I talked to like, 10 or 15 people. And if you want to talk to me about it, that's fine. Um, I think most people people have been completely just like gung ho saying fuck you we're not gonna let this stop our support of killstream honestly it's touching I, I don't know how to say it uh but it really is like just a great feeling go ahead Gorsuch. yeah well i love sucking dick <laughs> damn he got you there ralph <laughs> yeah i noticed that um but honestly yeah it's, it's been a good feeling because it could have went the other way, you know what I mean? Um, and I think they counted on me not addressing it or me, like, trying to act like it wasn't happening, Gator, or sweep it under the rug or some shit. Uh, but it's like, okay. At first, I, I wasn't that I wasn't acting like it didn't happen. That I was acting like it didn't happen. I want to make sure, okay, it's not bullshit. Like, there is some info they got out. All right, let's address it. I talked to Secure Server. I talked to their legal counsel. I did this. I did that. All right, let's send our email. So at first, I was like, okay, we got a little time to send email. Well, we didn't because all of a sudden these spur started sending out fake emails. So it's like, okay, I got to send out an email now. Okay, so I'm sitting here on the Las Vegas Strip. There's a fire that just happened. I'm typing in an email on my mobile phone. And so I, I had to make sure I did that, though, because it's my responsibility. I, I was talking to somebody, and they're like, oh, man, what the fuck? You know, that was your vacation the first day or two? I was like, well, yeah, because, you know, there, there's a lot of, uh, you know, when you sign up for this type of thing, that's the type of thing you sign up for. Uh, you get a lot of benefits. There's a lot of cool things I can do that other people can't do, like go live in Vegas for two weeks. Um, uh, et cetera. But, um, there's also uncool things like having to respond to people fucking with your website and shit like that. So, <laughs> so that's how it goes. All right, let's bring in more callers. We have more. Did you know that Gator? Kiosk man says, I think I might've read this earlier, but I'm going to read it again. Kiwi figs can't abort the retort. If anything, they inspired people to double down on supporting the kill stream. That's actually true. These figs are severely mentally ill shut-ins and social outcasts trying to trying desperately to gain some some sort of self worth by attacking Ralph. That's exactly true. It's so true. It's pretty accurate, actually. It's like they have nothing else in their life. Chaos Man says unpunctual, trans, and muted. Chris Dubs says check Twitter DMs. 
Pinochet's commie copter says, it would have been funnier if this was the guy who pulled the statue on that one black guy's head. It would have made this a better timeline. Cool hand, James. Shout out to him. All right, now, let's see. Let me check Cash App as well. They are really ass hurt that this this whole thing no, didn't, they like, thought it was destroy gonna, the show. Yeah, they thought it was going to just, like, sink me, kill Killstream.tv, and actually, it just made people even more diehard. Uh, and you know what? I want to shout out. First off, I want to shout out Pond. Uh, I don't know. I, I think a lot of people watching the show know who Pond is already. Uh, Pondul. Yeah, but she's Rand's ran, uh, co-host. She's Rambot's co-host and and like a so secretary, whatever you want to call her. Uh, I, not better than secretary. I, you know, whatever. Um, what would be the term? Executive, executive assistant. Maybe that would be. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah, executive that, assistant. Maybe that would be a little bit better. It's but, Wrangler, if yes, you will. Yes, but she's great anyway. Uh, and you know what? She is different than me, uh, in a good way. And uh, we've had we've clashed before actually, uh, but she's a really great person uh, in reality, and she she did a lot of uh, great things this weekend, uh, trying to let everybody know what happened, uh, and getting in contact with me and helping coordinate, um, you know, some of the response and and all that. Uh, just just a really great just a really great gal, I have to say. And so I just wanted to take some time out to say that during the show. Of course, Rand's great too, but uh, he wasn't out there uh, putting in work on that this weekend, and she was. So I want I want to thank her a lot, and uh, it re it really did it really did help. And also, you know, their whole goal was to do what they did and to also make it like, oh, Ralph's ignoring what's happening, or or Ralph's trying to lie basically or whatever and that was not the case at all obviously i sent out the email and i was on twitter even before that but that was their whole goal because i guess they thought i was going to ignore it or act like it didn't happen or whatever um now what i did want to do was be you know like accurate and and knowledgeable with what i was saying right i didn't just want to go out there and say some shit just to say some shit so i did wait a little bit longer than i would have preferred to be honest uh, but that's part of the deal, right? So I had I had to wait for a little while and let him go out a little bit because I had to make sure I knew what was going on. Once I knew what was going on, I came through and said my shit. But Pond was out there following it the whole time. So shout out to Pond. And yes, I see Rand was sick. I wasn't throwing Rand under the bus at all. Um, great guy. He has. There's no reason for him to be on point with it anyway. Um, I, and really, no reason for Pond to be either. Uh, so that's why I wanted to thank her too. Just a really great, a really great effort, and I think uh, I think things because of her uh, and some other people, Kaz as well, who helped me put together the email list, and and Gator was there, and everybody was talking to me, Pantsu as well. Um, I think because of those people, it didn't turn out how they thought it was going to turn out. So um, I, I just want to thank everybody there, and especially Pod, because she was really good. So. All right, now what are we gonna do, Gator? That's enough fuzziness. That's enough fuzzy wuzziness. I can't. I can't be like that. I have to be an asshole. What the fuck? All right. You know what? <laughs> Hold on. Let me see here. Chris Stubbs wants me to play this. Gator stepped away for a sec. By the way, it's just me now. Let me play this. Respect snakes, and I heard you ran over a couple snakes. Reptiles. Do you know what they are, Sue? So, so you do you know what a reptile is? You're a kiwi farm. You guys are fucking losers, dude. No, we're part of Kenny Jones' gang. We're part of the Jones gang. And you're gonna respect us. We're not some kind of fucking bones. No, you're some kiwi. <laughs> this, is, this is so fucking gay what you're doing, man. Fucking calling people. <laughs> You're fucking taking people's information, trying to harass people. You guys are a bunch of fucking <laughs> that need to get a life. So no, 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 that's not true. No, that's not true. It was probably you who was the Kiwi formal. You know what? Oh, 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 eat a fucking dick. I'll call you a fucking Uber. Is that is that fucking Sika Loader, dude? That dude is like the biggest <laughs> of all time. <laughs> like, I swear to God, I would knock his teeth down his throat if I ever seen him. <laughs> 
What a fuck. First off, it's not even funny. Like, he's the one that spurred out and like got mad and hung up. Fucking bunch of spurgs, man. Holy fuck. Way to get caught and called out. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, dude. Oh, Holy my shit. God. How fucking pathetic. We have is your that? information. <laughs> How pathetic is Sika, dude? Holy shit. He sat here and tried to get our favor for like a year and a half. And we told him to fuck off and die. And now he's like calling up subscribers. How pathetic. How absolutely pathetic. Snakes and I heard it is Sika, too. Like, there's no doubt it's him. Holy shit. What a f. Anyway.